it's that time of year when zucchinis are becoming abundant. So today I'm going to show you how to preserve these in a way that you will have them available for months and months to make lasagna with. You can cut these into thin strips and use them as a pasta substitute. Last year I messed around and I dehydrated a bunch of that and it's fantastic. Let me show you. So these were dehydrated probably about 10 months ago and they look great still. They're not quite as crispy as when I first dehydrated them but considering they've been in our garage in a Ziploc for a good 10 months and they are still in edible shape. Not too bad. So we use these just like you'd use lasagna. We take a pan, put a little bit of sauce in the bottom, and just layer down the zucchini as if they were noodles. And on top of this, we just put whatever filling we want. I like to use a lot of sauteed vegetables and then just put the sauteed vegetables, layer more zucchini sauce, sauteed vegetables, zucchini sauce. You can put whatever you usually put in your own lasagnas, but the zucchini noodles are a fantastic substitute, and you can grow them yourself by the gazillions in your own garden. For me, this has really been a game changer on what to do with all that extra zucchini. It's been a fantastic way that we really like to eat it during the months when we don't have it fresh. So I'll show you how I do this. I use a mandolin slicer and I make really thin slices. Then we're going to take them out and layer them on the rack. All right, once the tray is full, they're gonna go into the dehydrator. Now how long this dehydrating process takes completely depends on where you live. So it's pretty humid where I'm at and so I'll check these tomorrow and see how they're doing. Also depends on the equipment you use. You could do them in the oven, you can do them on a rack outside. And then when, when you pull them out, they're crispy. They're gonna be crispy like a cracker crispy. And then for storage, we just piled them into a Ziploc bag and squeezed out the air by hand and stuck them in the garage. And they lasted all fall, all winter, all spring and they're still in good shape now. Well, that's all I've got for today. So until next time, see ya.